we doing on time, Tony? Okay, you've got about 23 minutes left here. 
Absolutely white. Right here. Well, take your old thing and do a exploratory there for a while. Would suggest that. Oh, I just, if it's... Look. Look at that. Come over here. Yeah. Look at that. Give me a shot. How about doing the skim well, right I here? I just want you to look here. Okay, the top, uh... Okay. You know, had a perfect view. You got just like a scoop here and no skim. Charlie's right. Everywhere on... Okay. Okay. Okay, Tony, let me describe what it is. The top, uh, the top centimeter of the regolith is gray, and you get down under that, and it's white. All right, Just can we a copy that? Different albedo, three shades, uh, three shades different. Got to be able to see that in the TV right there, Houston. All right, we can. I'll dig you a little, dig you a little trench here. Boy, that's gonna be a hard job, John. Can you see that, Houston? We'll sample uh, right there and get you a, a scoop full of this underlying uh, regolith. Okay, uh, I guess... It really uh, is a different albedo. It's amazing. All right, we can see that here. Why don't you go ahead and get a bag of the dark and a bag of the light, and then we'll press on to that uh, blocks on the north uh, northwest side. All right. Boy, my kids don't get as dirty as you are. Man, we, <laughs> well, we're having, I bet they don't have, not having as much fun either. Yeah, I bet you're right. It sure is neat here. Okay, let me get a shovel full of this. Right off the top here. Okay. There we go. Ah, look at that finger. Pick that up with one finger. Ah, uh, that's there like a touch. Get the bag out. Oh, that's. John, we're going to have to change that bag dispenser. That is terrible. There another one? Do we have another yeah, one? Yeah, we got another one under my seat. <clears throat> okay. Okay. That is going, that top scoop is going in bag 352, Houston. Okay, 352. Okay, 357. You fellas are ready packing them away there. Down sun, down 
around Faye, John. Tony, looking... That's what I was trying to tell you, yeah. John. Looking uh, down sun here, down phase, at this area down slope, uh, you get a definite uh, feeling of lineation that runs southwest, northeast uh, from Stone Mountain. Uh, they're sort of little uh, furrowed uh, ridges and pits and things. Okay, you don't see any sharp scarps or anything like that, though. No, no sir. No, nothing like on that map. Right. Oh, no, it's worse. Well, I'll tell you. There's, there's a hole that's basically in zero phase. Well, I'm out of water. Drinking water, that is. Well, oh, okay. <laughs> hey, John, you want to try, try just a piece of that? Look at that, Charlie. What's that? That thing has, though. Has greenish black class in it, right there in that boulder there. I, it looked like it to me too. Yeah, let's see if we can get a piece of that. Okay, Tony, this is a uh, sub-rounded rock uh, boulder that's a meter to a meter and a half across. It has a predominant fracture set, uh, 20 centimeters on a side, uh, that run uh, uh, here southeast. Uh, correction, uh, southwest northeast. Is the predominant fracture set. And it's okay. Over, and it's partially buried. What's up? Okay, and John, over here also, as we as we uh, move around, that very white material is right under the uh, uh, right under John's uh, feet. I'll take a picture of that. And he's really changed the uh, the albedo by kicking into this little crater by this big rock. He'll get out. Ah, here he comes, folks. He's got the hammer out. I knew he couldn't resist. <laughs> I don't know if this will work or not, Charlie. But it couldn't pick a better spot. There we go. Gonna do it. There's a piece. Hold you down a little bit. Cat dog, he did it. It's a very friable rock, apparently, Houston. Okay, outstanding. Charlie, don't do that. Let me do it. I got it. Leaning on the shovel. Okay, Houston, it's got some uh, green class. Some white class, uh, a grayish matrix. The class are a millimeter size and make up 5% uh, of the rock. One big crystal, five millimeters across it. I can't tell what it is, but it's a beauty. Okay, do you think that's still a uh, No. Uh, I'm not sure, John. I think it might be, uh, yeah, I think it's a breccia, really. It's very friable. Yeah, it has a little, it, it's a breccia, you Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or a welded, uh, no, it's not right. It's, it's a breccia, and it, I can see at least, there's, like Charlie says, there's two or three different type class in it. I don't, I, just a one stage breccia, though, it looks like. It's going in the bag 353. Okay, 353, and, and you've got this, about uh, uh, nine minutes until you have to leave. All right, uh, we'd like to go out and get one of those sharp rocks and a soil sample here. Okay, sounds good. And while you're taking pictures there, if you could take some pictures of the lineations on the ground you talked about. Yeah, I'll do that when I get to the right spot. Okay. Okay, I'm taking a soil sample of the fillet around this rock. Okay. Boulder. John, you just whacked that beauty right off of there. Uh, like you say, it's friable. Uh -huh. <laughs> I hit it on a fracture set, too. Yeah. Can turn that shovel that way. 360. 
368, this oil. Okay, I'll get the after on that, John. Okay. Charlie's getting the after on that soil of 368. Done. If you have time, could we do a second pan from here? Yeah, yeah. I'm supposed to do that, ain't I? Yeah, I was, I was just thinking about that. That'd be a good idea. We're right on the rim of... Uh, we're really right on the rim. This rock's right on the uh, on the rim of uh, both Plum and uh, Flag. Yeah, my guess is the uh, rock is uh, the way it's laid in here is probably from the bottom of Plum somewhere or down there somewhere. Okay, John, I'm going to go over here and get a get some of these lineations. Okay. Close up. That's pretty spectacular.
It's my hammer, Charlie. Boy, how'd that come out? I don't know. I'll get it, John. I can do it with a shovel, easy. Glad you saw that. there there's a rock in the near field on this rim that has some white on the top of it we'd like you to pick it up as a grab sample this one right here that's it this, this one right here that's it you got it right there okay that's a that's a, that's a football size rock it's a great scott size sure you want to rock that big Houston? Yeah, let's go ahead and get it. That's a 20 pounds of rock right there. Okay. That's a big class in it, John. It sure is. Okay, and we'll need an EMU check before you drive off. Stand by. Hey, I'm running at 48%, 3.87. I'm on the uh, halfway between intermediate and minimum, and I didn't have any flags. We got to do something with this bag before we leave, Charlie. Put it on your seat. Under my seat. Okay, Tony, I'm clear on the flags. Uh, my frame count is uh, 65. I've got uh, what you got, Charlie. It looks like I'm at about uh, 35%, and I'm in it between intermediate and uh, uh, men, and I'm at 385. 
Okay. Okay, make sure you're in men, I guess, before we get in and yeah, start okay. driving. Going to men, that's a good point. Thanks. Okay. Leaps. Okay. Single bound. Boat switch is going to one, Houston. Okay. 